your back, excuse me, draw your knees into your chest and rock on your spine from side to side, just shaking it out. a little hug and release your feet heels down take your hands behind your head and draw your chin to your chest and slowly come up and back so get little yoga bodies plus push your low back into the mat as you draw up and down Warming up our low belly. Stay up here and hold. Draw your low belly all the way down and in. And come up and down a few more times. Good. And then you can draw your head all the way down and we're just gonna tap our heels up and down. Pull the low belly in, tapping your heels up and down. You want to tuck that belly in. You can look up at your belly or you can stay flat on your back. Either way. Elbows are nice and wide if you're up. Now bring both feet up and tap down and lift back up. Pull that low belly in. You're just tapping down and drawing your shins parallel to the ceiling. Good, warming up through the belly. Low back is down, make sure there's no arch in your back as you tap up and down. Now keep both feet up and lower and lift your head. Nice. Now take your elbow to the opposite knee and tap your elbow towards the right knee, left elbow to right knee. Exhale your breath as you come up. Good, you're, you're doing great, but not easy. Let's do the other side. Right elbow to left knee, exhale your breath. Now let's alternate opposite tap. So tap your toe down and alternate. Breathing, exhaling, low belly down, low back down. Now hold this right knee up and pulse it, left elbow to right knee. You can hold your left foot up or tap it down. Stay here, extend your left leg out, lift up and down. Exhale your breath. Two more. Now come back up, alternate and tap right elbow to left knee. Breathing, exhaling. I know you feel it. I feel it with you. Oops. Tap. And extend that left foot down. You can bring this right foot down if you like. Right leg up and down. Lift up.
two more. Now, little pulses for 10. Five more, four breathing, three, two, one, and release. Uh, pull your knees into your chest, give yourself a hug, and shake it from side to side. Rock it out, shake it out. Open and close those knees. Breathing and relaxing. Lift your legs straight up, point and flex your toes. Circle your ankles. Draw your left leg down, right knee in, give it a tug. And then switch sides. Good. Now go ahead and bring your knees up, bring the soles of your feet together and let your knees come out as wide as you can. Take your hands behind your head and we're just gonna do little tiny roll-ups here. Pull your belly in. Now little pulses, 10 of them. Exhale your breath. Three, two, one. Hold it up and just extend the right leg, tap it down, extend the left. Extend right, low back all the way down and left. Breathing. Good, keep it up. Five more. Three more. Last one. Good, bring the soles of the feet together and lift your legs and lower. Pull that low belly down. Two more. Good, hold it up or lay flat, extend your legs out, pull them in. So your head can be down or you can hold your head up either way. Breathe it out. Soles the feet together, knees out wide as we exhale. Three more. Nice, and then bend your knees, give yourself a hug. Rock your spine from side to side. Shake it out. Beautiful. All right, bring your hands to the side. Take your knees up and we're gonna rock our knees from left to right, nice and slow. Gaze straight up as you rock your knees, nice and slow, from left to right. Keep your knees together if you can. If you need to separate the legs to lift up, that's fine. But if you can, keep those knees together as you rock from side to side. Nice flat arms. Exhale your breath. Now, two more and we're gonna extend our legs. those legs up nice and high and bring your legs all the way down. Good. Exhale as the legs come down. Connect those palms to the sides. 
of your body. As you exhale, you bring it down. Let's do three more. direction. Nice. Bring your legs back up. Oh, pull, pull those arms out nice and wide. And bring your left leg down and then lift up. And then your right leg down and lift. Left. Nice and slow. Pull that belly in and right. Do a few more. Good, last one. And bring it all the way back up. Give yourself a hug. Tug it in. Shake your hips from right to left. And then we're going to place our hands down by your side and roll your hips up. You should feel a nice little stretch in the front of your hips. After all that work, squeeze your glutes and lower down. Nice and slow. Lift up. Squeeze. And lower. Lift up, squeeze. Squeeze it in. Nice and slow. Really engage your core. Three more. Hold it up, squeeze it up, and then pulse it up. Flatten out those feet as you squeeze and lift your glutes. Squeeze it for 10. You got it. Squeeze it in. Five more. Hold it and squeeze. Keep it contracted. Three more breaths. And then slowly lower your spine and take your right leg and lift it up. Push that left sole of your foot into the mat. We're going to lift straight up and down. Pull your belly in. Hold it up there, hold it and pulse it for 10. Keep those hips squared to the ceiling. Three more. Now hold it up and lower that right leg down and lift. Pull your belly in. Squeeze it up. going. Two more. Last one. Hold it and then lower your spine. Bring your right foot down. Give it a hug. Shake it from side to side. Take your left leg out. Open and close this right hip. So 
circle it around. And then go ahead and bring both knees back up, feet down. Lift and lower your hips. Squeeze it 10 times. Nice and slow. Draw that low back all the way down. Engage your low belly. Last one. Hold it up. Now pulse it. Four more. And hold it up. Hold it and squeeze as you breathe. Three more breaths. Slowly, gently lower your spine and draw your left leg up. We're going to lift up. Squeeze that right glutes. Push into the sole of the right foot as you lift and lower. Engage your low belly. Three more. Last one. Now hold it up and pulse it up. Three more, three, two, one. Lower that leg and lift. Keep those hips up, keep them square to the ceiling. Breathing. Good, almost there. Last one. And then lower your spine. Take your right leg out, pull your left knee into your chest. Rock it from side to side. Circle it around. As you give it a hug. Go ahead and grab both your knees, tuck them into your chest, and shake from side to side. Nice. Open the knees wide. And then close your knees. Perfect. And then go ahead and reach your hands right underneath your low back, make a little diamond, and we're gonna stretch our legs all the way out. And lift your legs up and pull them back. And then slowly lower down. So we're gonna pull that belly and lift up and back and slowly roll down. Legs lift, reach up, use your low belly, and slowly roll down. You got this. Slowly move through this. It's slow motion, leg drops and lifts. Use your low belly, reach back. Slowly release. Good. Option to move your hands away from your low back and let your hands freely come to the side of your mat. It is a little bit more challenging. It's a little bit more difficult. My dog wants to join us. Now he's going to get right underneath my bottom. Let's do five more. Relax your neck. 
Use your core to draw your legs down. Three more. Good, let's do one more and then hold it above your head and lift your legs up and down. Squeeze your belly in. Pull that low belly in. Two more. And then lower back down, keep your legs up. And we're gonna drop our legs down. And you can bring your hands behind your back, behind your glutes. Leg drops, nice and slow. Control it down, lift it up. Six more. got this. Three more. Last one. Tuck your knees in. Give yourself a hug. Shake it from right to left. And then go ahead and draw your legs down and roll yourself up. Engage that core. I'm gonna move my blanket out of the way. It's too slippery. Plus it's warm in here. All right, so the next thing we're gonna do is take our arms above our head and take a fold. Folding over your feet, stretching through your shoulders as you shake from side to side. And then draw your arms forward, flex your feet, and we're gonna roll down to our spine, one vertebrae at a time. So nice and slow, one vertebrae at a time. And take your arms above your head. Start to draw your arms up, release your shoulders, slowly, shoulders. Low back, rounding through your spine, and draw forward. Roll up, slowly roll down, one vertebrae at a time, so draw your belly in, curve your spine like a C. So slow, and reach your arms above your head. Take your arms right in front of your chest, start to roll up, one vertebrae at a time. Flex your feet if you can, pull your belly in as you roll forward. Roll it down, one vertebrae at a time. We're gonna do three more. Two more. Arms up, roll it up. Last one, all the way through, back to sitting up, one vertebrae at a time. Pull your belly in, round through your spine. Bring your arms up, last time, roll it up. And come forward, fold. Take your head 
head, nod your head yes and no, and then roll yourself up, bend your knees, halfway through class, you guys are doing great, take a big stretch, shake your head out, and then bend your knees, give yourself a little humble yogi hug. And from a seated pose like so, with our knees bent, we're gonna roll up. So take your arms forward, see if you can flatten out your back, lift your right leg up into your hand. If that doesn't work, draw it down. And then release your right leg and roll down, tuck your belly in, and then take your arms above your head. Take your arms back up, roll up, and reach for that leg. So we'll do the right side only. Roll it down one vertebrae at a time. Look at your foot, look at your ankle. Roll down and extend. Reach the arms up. Squeeze your core as you lift up and hold. Good, option to release that leg and roll down. If you can straighten out your spine, I think we have four more. Reach it up. And lift. Three more. Two more. Pull that belly in. Almost there. One more time. You can do it. Last one. Reach it up. Lift up. Bend your right knee. Give yourself a nice humble yogi hug. Shake your head. Draw your hands to your knees, little cat cow. And we have the other side to do. So go ahead and lift that left leg up. Draw those arms out. You can hold on to that leg. You want a nice long spine. And then roll it down one vertebrae at a time. a little fast, try to move a little slower, reach it up, really squeeze and lift, nice. Pull that up, ooh, I felt that one. Roll it down one vertebrae at a time. Connect to that core. Good. Let's do four more. Squeeze it in. Lift yourself up. Pull it in. Nice. Three more. And then we have one more. We're almost there. Perfect. Bring yourself all the way back up. Nice. 
and then release that foot. Give yourself a hug. Shake it from side to side. Good. Take your hands behind you. Palms can face back. Actually, palms forward, elbows back. Draw your knees into your chest and then just alternate right and left leg. So draw those elbows behind you, alternating right and left. Pull that low belly in. Good, five more. Pull the belly in, almost there. And the last one, and release, come forward. Give yourself a nice big, all the way back to your spine, roll it back. Tuck your knees into your chest and rock from side to side. Good. Bring your feet down. Take your right ankle over the left knee and take your left shin parallel to the ceiling. Take your hands behind your head and then take your left elbow to that right knee. See if you can leave your left shin parallel to the ceiling as you bring your left elbow to right knee. your breath. Stay over to this right side and tap the elbow. Come back to center and lift your uh, chest straight up. Little tiny little crunches here. Chin is parallel to your feet. So have this little orange between your chin and your chest and your gaze is up. your heel and lift. Last one. Draw your left foot down. Bring your right foot all the way to the left. Lay your head down. Reach your arms to the side and look towards your right hand. Roll it back to center. And then draw your left leg back up. Reach your hands behind your leg. Stretch your right hip. And then go ahead and release. Take your right foot down, left ankle crosses the right knee, and lift your right shin up. Hands behind your head. We're going to bring right elbow to left knee. Tap it out. Exhale when you come across. Now hold it here and pulse it 10 times. Remember to keep that little fist 
between the chin and the chest. Look straight up. Last one. Tap. You can lay your head back or keep your chin up. Tap your right heel down. to the right, open your arms and look to your left, let your hips stretch as you breathe, you guys did great, good, come back to center, release your left foot, Go ahead and draw your knees into your chest and then open and close your legs. It's releasing your hips. Reach between your inner thighs and grab your big toes as you shake out your happy baby. Take a long breath in. Big exhale. Good. Bring your knees together. Take your right foot back down. Cross your left ankle. Didn't forget. Bring your right hand. Your hands underneath your right leg as you stretch this left hip. legs. Give yourself a rock and roll on your spine a few times. And then roll all the way up. Push those hips back. Take a long stretch up and fold. Give a little half lift of your chest. Fingertips to shins. And fold. You can roll yourself up. You guys did an awesome job. Have a wonderful rest of your day. I hope you enjoyed that Pilates. And I will see you next week for more Yoga Pilates. Bye, everybody.